20-year-old Coburg man has undergone painful surgery after suffering serious burns from a hot water bottle. His mother's calling for them to be banned after it spontaneously ruptured. Neary Tai has the details. The wounds are too raw to show, but the bandages display just how much this 20-year-old's body has been damaged. His body went into shock and he was trembling. Um, yeah, it was a horrific sight to see. I wouldn't wish it upon anybody. Marie McCarra's son was playing PlayStation last week. He had an old hot water bottle sitting on his lap when it burst. He said, I'm on fire, Mum, I'm on fire. So he was burning. Suffering serious burns, the apprentice carpenter stripped down before paramedics arrived, giving him a shot of morphine. We still had him under the cold shower because the minute he stepped back from that shower, he was on fire. After spending a week inside the burns unit at the Alfred Hospital. Second slash third degree burns all over his chest and his thighs and in the palm of his hands, superficial burning on his neck and all over his arms. He underwent painful surgery today for a skin graft. It's extremely concerning for us because these injuries are entirely preventable. Having a look at a hot water bottle from the outside, it might look like it's in really good condition, but the hot water that's been put into the hot water bottle can deteriorate the plastic and the seals on the inside, and then they can spontaneously rupture. The ACCC says all hot water bottles made from PVC must have warning labels. Consumers are urged to replace them every 12 months. Do not fill it with boiling water. Instead, use hot tap water and fill it no more than two thirds. Use a fitted cover or have it wrapped to avoid direct contact with your skin and never have it on your body for more than 20 minutes. Water bottles do have and do need to meet Australian standard design regulations and importantly that ensures that the risk of injury from a water bottle is reduced. Currently there's a recall on these spotlight products with fears the stopper could leak or seams could split. I say get rid of your hot water bottle. We've all got one of them lying around our homes and it's a hazard waiting to happen. Neary Tai, Nine News.